great feeling to come out here and you see something that not a whole lot of people have seen you know you get a rush every time you pull up on one because you you know you're not gonna know what's gonna happen you know we grab a hold of this animal that doesn't want to be grabbed it's gonna turn around and try to bite you and that's about what happens every single time so it's definitely a rush we did all the bird monitoring for this project and when once the birds start nesting we go in and make sure that the nesting is actually occurring and see if there's any eggs in the nests and one of the trips in we found uh, a pretty large Burmese python that was in the, in the nesting colony and it was eating the birds in the colony. So we tracked it for about three days before we actually found it and was able to um, euthanize it and take it out. But during the necropsy they found a lot of the, the waiting birds inside its stomach. So it was definitely eating the, the birds that were nesting over in that area. And it just kind of got hooked from there. So I think last, was it last year I caught five gravid females. And they each had 25 eggs, so if you think about it, that's 100 pythons that were removed just by taking out five snakes. Yeah, this is the black racer. Pretty common throughout here in South Florida. Um, they're distinguished by that white belly. It's definitely a rush, but you know, it's important that we remove these things from the Florida Everglades and get the, uh, the snakes to the researchers so they can get the data they need so we can hopefully help remove these from the Everglades.